think you should be. Hello and welcome to me reviewing, I guess, the new Season 6 trailer. Uh, this is the gameplay trailer. I'm just gonna hop right into it. Grab your mash. What is that even supposed to mean? Okay, Rampart's in town. She has a machine gun. Yay. Octane gets shot because he has fucking shit abilities and Wraith just phases. What's new? The lifeline's gonna get melted as soon as that Pathfinder gets picked up. I don't even know why they included this shot in the trailer. Okay, that's a cool execution, though. All the animations look a little off in this trailer, just from the start. Ooh. Okay, we got a really cool G7 skin, except they're using iron sights. But nobody, the iron sights suck. Anyway, just to show off the skin, it is a really cool skin, and I'm assuming that's gonna be the Battle Pass level 100. And Bangalore got a new skin, and guess what? It still sucks, because they can't make a good skin for Bangalore. They just change some colors, and then they always mess up what she looks like, because they can't give her a good skin. Oh, lots of different guns here. Let's go back and look at those real quick. New battle pass. Triple take, another nice G7, but gold. A devotion skin, it's okay. Cool little octane skin combinations, a cool Pathfinder skin, and a really cool Bloodhound skin with a cool G7 skin. So lots of cool skins. Happy about that. World's Edge Fortified. All right, let's go back and look at. Okay, so just looking at this, this seems to be where the har or just outside of Harvester. Uh, it looks like you could fall into the edge of the map over here. Some lava. I mean, something new. I mean, that, that doesn't look too impressive to me. Uh, this is this little wasteland area between Train Yard and Harvester. So I guess a lot more stuff over near the center of the map, which should keep people from just walking around the outside edges, not doing anything. Now, over here by Mirage Ship, I'm assuming Mirage Ship is removed. It looks like we got some moving platforms and stuff, which could be kind of fun and interesting to play with. Hopefully you can control them or something, or they just constantly move. Crafting. I, I have no idea how this is going to work. Oh, great. Everybody stands still on the crafting station and gets sniped. Is, is that what it... Hold on, we're going back. What did, what did that say on the thing? Permanent. Oh, you can upgrade your Evo shields? Wow, so even if you do absolutely nothing in the game, you can still level up your shields. Daily. So the guns are going to change daily, which means you're just going to get into a lobby and everybody's going to have a devotion. I assume. And they brought back energy mags? Uh, I feel like that's a little too much loot. 50 bucks for a respawn beacon, that's not... I mean, that's okay, I guess. And the turbocharger's back. Uh, I don't know how I feel about that, because the devotion's kind of broken. I hope they changed it. Yeah, here comes that squad ready to third-party them. They're just about to get absolutely melted. Alright, well, here's the devotion. Yeah, same as normal. I assume it'll probably be broken. Oh, the new weapon, the vault. Okay, this is what I'm kind of excited about. We got some decent fire rate and a quick reload. I really like that. That's keeping true to kind of the Titanfall 2 quick reload and, you know, decent fire rate. So I assume it's going to be the energy weapon equivalent to the alternator. And I haven't seen an R99, which probably means it is taken out of the loot pool, which some people suggested. All right, now it's going to show us some of Rampart's new abilities. Oh, God. Okay, so a wall. Oh, jeez. Oh, God, this looks terrible. Anybody can use Rampart's gun and her wall. I mean, imagine the third party is just getting lasered from a mile away. You're in the middle of a fight, and there's some fucking dweebs up on a hill with amped walls. Doesn't even matter if you have a crave, you're just gonna get lasered. Ugh. Which is, again, look at poor Octane and his crap ability. What they need to do is give him shield when he bounces off his jump pad. 25 temporary shield and it goes away. Or something so he has an ability or some way he can push people. Because he'll just get lasered every time. Something big is on the horizon. Wow, it's almost like the horizon should be the next fucking season. 
but you know, this looks like this game's dying. <sighs> All right, well, hopefully mid-season the stupid lo rocket launches, because if we have to wait a whole goddamn season to get the new map, uh, a Apex is Apex is pretty much done for. I assume most people will stop playing this game. Yikes. Okay, coming August 18th. Well, I will probably play it because I got nothing better to do with my life, but uh, I'm going to complain about it the whole time. So thanks for checking in to my super pessimistic review of Apex Season 6. Season 6, I'm going to mark this as a steep decline. Apex is going to hit rock bottom after this. Season 7 will be pretty much non-existent. All right, anyway, that's uh, my theory for... Oh, this isn't even Thursday. What the fuck is this? Friday? Close enough. Who cares? All right, peace.